Please help me to like and subscribe to grow our channel. Trump calls Kavanaugh allegations a big fat con job. President Donald Trump worked to wrest his beleaguered Supreme Court nomination back from the brink on Wednesday, insisting allegations against Brett Kavanaugh were a politically motivated farce. At the same time, however, he frankly conceded his mind could be changed after watching a blockbuster Senate hearing set for Thursday morning. When one of Kavanaugh's accusers will detail her claims before the Judiciary Committee and a national television audience. And he admitted his view of sexual misconduct claims is colored by the litany of charges, all false. He claimed that women have lobbed against him for decades, I'm going to see what happens tomorrow. I'm going to be watching. I'm going to see what's said. It's possible they will be convincing, he said during a rare solo news conference. I can be persuaded also, the president said. I can't tell you if they're liars until I hear them. Embittered at how a once-assured confirmation process for Kavanaugh has unraveled, Trump was hoping to regain back control during the early evening appearance in New York. It's only the second time he's held a solo news conference on U.S. soil as president. He stood by his decision not to call on the FBI to reopen its background investigation of Kavanaugh and repeated his insistence the parade of accusations against Kavanaugh amount to a big fat con orchestrated by Democrats. He even suggested that President George Washington, who he recalled had a couple of bad things in his past, may be maligned by modern-day Democrats. But asked directly whether there is a scenario in which he could withdraw Kavanaugh's nomination, Trump indicated there was.